When it comes to SeaKeeper, there's a popular story we like to tell around the office that when the product first came out, founder Shep McKenney was trying to get some publicity about this new product that was going to change boating forever. The editor-in-chief at the time, Richard Thiel, he was skeptical, but Shep persisted. He invited him down, invited him down, finally offered to fly Richard down. You have to test this product. Well, he ended up winning. Long story short, he won Richard's endorsement, came down, and we like to say Paramordiot helped get the start, but the proof was in the pudding. Seakeeper went on over the years since 2008 to change the course of boating from super yachts to small center consoles. The brand has really become like the Band-Aid brand of stabilization. They're the name. So it's been really cool to be out here today in the choppy waters off Atlantic City, New Jersey, testing out the second product from this company in the Seakeeper Ride. Now this is really a transom control system that can be on entry level boats, 19, 35 feet and beyond. And it controls things like reduces pitch and roll. It impacts time to plane, it limits bow rise. And they have all these stats, or they have all these numbers about roll reduction, pitch reduction, but it's the kind of experience you truly have to feel to believe. It makes for a smoother ride. It makes for a calmer ride. It feels like the seas are instantly cut in half. We did a lot of testing with the system on, then off, then on again. And you don't need any of these indicator lights to tell you when it's on and off. This thing really glues into the water and, and rides straight on rails. So it's, it's been really cool coming out here, being among the first to test this system. You want to stay tuned for the full report in an upcoming issue of Power Motoryat or online at pmymag.com. I'm going to test it out just, just a little more.